Hello everyone, this is Mara and welcome back to The Sims 2 New Haven. It has been a while since the last episode, but we are back. <laughs> we are back here in the lovely New Haven. And in the previous episode, we actually had a little poll going about who's going to be the teacher of New Haven. And first of all, thanks so much for the, uh, for the votes, guys. All of you guys who did vote for that... Uh, that teacher's posi position. <laughs> Thank you so much for that. And it was interesting. Uh, we actually had a um, couple of sims that are potentially going to be uh, playable sims in the herd who are townies at the moment. But we had a clear winner and she's right here. So this redhead right here. There we go. Um, on the right here, this is Suzanne Caliente and she won the uh, straw poll and she's also going to be the teacher um, at the town school so that's very exciting and we also have some other new playable sims here I forgot their names <laughs> forgive me guys it has been a while since the last episode like I said but uh, I'm I, I'm pretty sure that the guy with the re green shirt there is Ferdinand something <laughs> But anyway, he's going to be the uh, pet store owner. Very exciting. And I also decided to make playable those uh, other two sims who had the same last name. And they are siblings in my game now. So there we go. And I actually have a couple of other uh, playable, uh, a couple of other townies that I was planning on making playable sims. Like for example, the... Um, the guy, what's his name? <laughs> Lonnie Barton, I think. Anyway, he's the one who uh, became friends with our wonderful James, our founder, one of our founders back there. And he is the um, the Garden Club sim, the Garden Club leader, so to speak. And I was, think I was thinking that I'm uh, probably going to make him a playable sim too, so that he can actually manage the gardening areas here he can he can improve our islands here he can add some some more scenery some more plants and all that good stuff there so that's my plan but today we are not going to play with this household even though i was originally planning that we are possibly going to move them in but i'm still uh figuring out what i want to do or where i want them to move they are they are there are going to um live in the same household they're going to have kind of like a little b and b going uh where the sims are going to be renting rooms and i placed a couple of lots down it's the same template that i used for the town school but I'm not completely sure if I want them to move here or not. They're going to have the uh, the lot is going to have different sort of um, floor plan of obviously uh, than the school. So it's basically it's not going to be the same one. But I'm not sh I'm not really sure if I want to um, use too many of these lots here. But anyway, it's it's a work in progress. We'll see how it goes. But potentially they're going to move here. I did some some uh, tiny renovating here already changed the wallpapers and whatnot but that's not what we are going to do, do today do today and forgive me guys it has been a actually a little while since i did any recording so my <laughs> english is a little bit poopy today but anyway let's move on so i actually uh did something here i placed some lots here some one by one lots that i made for clayfield actually so these are basically temp uh, template lots for tiny businesses and i placed them here they are going to uh, change quite a lot we can actually alter them however we see fit so they are probably not going to have this look it's just a very basic um vanilla wallpapers and whatnot but they are here to kind of give an idea what i had in mind so since they are uh individual lots one by one lots we are actually able to do quite a lot with this kind of lots and one of the ideas that i had is that we can actually kind of mix and match what comes to uh community lots and residential lots so some of these uh, these little lots here are going to actually be residential lots. So maybe some business owners can can buy some of the houses and whatnot. Some of them some of them can even be home businesses. 
and it would kind of look like you know that the store owner is living upstairs and runs runs the store downstairs but i'm i'm not really going to use too many home businesses since i do want my um my playable seems to be able to go there like when i'm controlling them and not only when when uh, they are going there without me controlling them, if that makes sense. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so this is this is going to be fun. We are going to have a lot of these little businesses here. And as you guys can see, I haven't done anything to the roads yet. It's still the old layout. But I had a plan that I'm actually going to, uh, for now, the kind of the uh, marketplace area sort of... Uh, thing that I had in mind is here and I don't really want it to be uh, this far away from the center of the island or the business community zone which is kind of somewhere like here so I was thinking that I'm going to move this eventually and it's going to be either here replacing these trees here or it's going to be here and I will probably remove these little, little roads here or do something else with this area so yeah, that's going to be changing. But anyway guys, today we are actually going to start making one of the little business lots and I'm really really excited. And that's something that we need to do anyway at some point and it's the uh, business lot for our good fellow Ferdinand here with the green shirt. So it's going to be the pet store of... of uh, I was about to say Clayville, no! <laughs> the pet store of New Haven. And this is something that I, I actually thought about quite a bit. Um, originally, I wanted to have a sort of like the same sort of um, animal shelter thing going on in these islands that I have in Clayfield. But in the end, it didn't really make any sense to me to have an animal shelter and basically strays running around. First of all, when I generated the townies, um, I was using clean templates. So I didn't have any strays uh, spawning. And there are no animals here at all at the minute. And I'm not really going to um, be spawning any any strays here. So I was thinking that the the way that we are going to um, go with the animals in New Haven is that we are going to have breeders. We are going to have um, different different dog breeds, mixed breeds. We are going to have cat breeders, so that the playable families are going to uh buy their pets that way or maybe a friend is going to have you know kittens and they will give one of the kittens to their uh, friend family or whatnot so that's the way that we are going to be rolling with this and there is going to be a pet store so that we can get started with pets i really miss playing playing with pets in sims 2 i haven't really played the game too much recently and we really need to get the pets going so let's go ahead and pop into the lot all right guys so this is how the basically the other end end lot looks this is the right right hand side end uh, lot basically and this is the left hand, left hand side and the middle one here the darker gray here is the uh center lot that can be duplicated so we can basically have this this lot types we can have several of them but this is going to be the um the end lot like i said if that makes any sense <laughs> not sure if that does but anyway yeah so to give you guys a little bit better understanding okay thank you thank you <laughs> there we go uh trying to remember how to play the game yeah to give you guys a little bit better understanding how the lots look so this is basically how each of these three lots look they have a slightly different layout because obviously uh this is the center lot so the staircase is is a little bit different but anyway it's basically the same and it looks very very plain because that's how i wanted it to look it's very empty it's very dull <laughs> and we are going to start working with this so this is uh, going to be the bathroom here the store is going to be downstairs and yeah actually it's going to be both both floors here the owner uh, Fernand is not going to be living here he's going to be living in the BNB like I said but really excited let's actually see I did want to let's just delete that 
And I did want to check. I wasn't wasn't sure about something. Um, yes, fantastic. Okay, yeah. So I just wanted to check if I use the the latte template so that we can actually uh, modify the exterior walls here and we can so that means that we can actually customize this quite a lot we can actually even make it look completely different for example i'm just i'm going to cancel this these actions later but to show you guys for example we can have a whole different look um at the front here but i think for now let's just go with the default what i had here and let's see, these lots are going to be so much more colorful. <laughs> but let's start with this, uh, with the win windows here. I think in this episode we are mainly probably going to focus on the um, the exterior, you know, the how the lot is going to be basically look. Um, sure, let's go with white. White windows, why not? And let's see. Yeah, so we are going to uh, check what kind of design we are going to go with for the building, building in general, and possibly some wallpapers and whatnot. And in the next episode, we are going to focus more on the interior decorating, which is going to be a lot of fun. All right, so let's see. Let's just go ahead and replace some of the windows okay that can actually be a bigger window uh, there we go yeah that's fine and let's go with the white one because why not and I think I want something else for the for the walls here too Hmm. Okay, let's. Whoops. Let's replace these first of all. And if you can hear some noise in the background, that's my puppy. <laughs> he's always very loud when he's sleeping. Oh, that's bright. Yeah. So I kind of want to go with something fun, something col colorful and fun. Ooh. Hmm, I actually really like that for some reason. Let's go with that. And do we have something else for the bottom, bottom layer? Hmm, let's go with that. Why not? <laughs> and I do want to switch the... Let's see, where, did, where is it even? Here. For the roof pattern. Hmm. No, not green. Not blue. Um. Hmm. Is this the one that we had originally? Let's check. I'm being silly. It's not. Okay, let's go with black. I like that. <laughs> I like that already. Alright. So, there we go. Um, I may actually end up changing this. I do want to have a display window here. So let's see. How do I want to do this? I'm pretty sure that we do have... No, not that. I'm pretty sure that we do have some... Some of the bigger windows. Let's see. Oh, we need to use this. Oh, that's adorable! <laughs> we need to use some of these um, these pet I pet items here. Um, hmm, we could go with something like that. Okay, so that's not going to have any recolors. Not sure why. It should have. Okay, there we go. Okay, that's two tiles. I need something, something even bigger. That's weird. This one should have some recolors. Hmm. Okay, let's see. What is this? All 
right. Yeah, it looks like my recolors are glitching for some reason. But, um, what is this? Oh, alright. That's not the one that I want. Do, do, do. Let's see, where is the single? Single window. Okay, it doesn't have any recolors. <laughs> that sucks. What's going on with this? Silly game. But anyway, um, hmm, I kind of do want to use that though. Are there any other bigger windows here? Not really what I'm looking for. All right, we are not going to spend too much time here. So, um, hmm. Let's actually go with this and let's see, maybe we can do something, something here. Uh, do, do, do. Why is it not working? Interesting. Need something to support it. Why? Why exactly is that? Okay, let's try this. Or oh, maybe it's just um, glitching because of the window. Let's try this. Hmm. Yeah, it's not going to let me place it there. But anyway, anyway, we can actually have some displays here, so it's not going to be a problem. We can have some displays here, and the Sims can can browse uh, through the window just fine and let's see I could actually add maybe another one here sure why not why not let's go with that at least for now we can always switch the uh, things around and let's see okay where's the window here we go. Let's use it for the bathroom, actually. <laughs> That's adorable. Oh my gosh. And oh my goodness. Okay, now that I remember it, so let's go and see. Where is the... There should be a sign somewhere here, right? A pet sign. Hmm, not sure where it is. Wall hangings. Definitely not there. <laughs> um, is it here? It might be. There's a lot of other random things here. Okay, let's see. Oh, there it is. Yeah, so before I forget, so let's add this here. Make a, a really, really adorable <laughs> pet store. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, so I think the uh, layout is going to work just fine downstairs let's go ahead and switch the staircase i really don't want to use that and let's go let's go and switch around things there we go and i can replace this too awesome there we go and is that going to bug me? Probably. <laughs> okay. Okay, yeah, I'm just figuring out what I want to do here. But let's go ahead. This really bugs me right now. It's so gray here. I need some color. And we need some more. Some more options. Let's see. Uh, hmm. Not that. Mm, not really what I'm looking for. Actually, should we go with with something like this? I mean, we are eventually going to have pets here. <laughs> uh, hmm. I wish we had some other colors. Yeah, that color is not what I want. <laughs> but, hmm. We actually have quite a few options here. 
Hmm. Uh, I can't make up my mind. Let's go with the yellow one. At least for now. <laughs> That's like my catchphrase or something. Okay. And let's... Do, do, do. Let's do something fun for the for the bathroom too. And tell us where are the hmm yellow? Okay, not that one. Hmm, okay. Where is it? <laughs> I feel like I went past it already. Yes, I did. Okay, so let's go with... Hmm. That's a little too much. <laughs> Just a little too much. Okay, let's go with that. That's fine. That's fine. I feel like we need a bigger window for the bath bathroom, actually. <laughs> Not that I think of it. But anyway, let's let's start with this. And let's replace the walls too to kind of give a little bit better better idea how the um how the downstairs is going to be looking. Okay, not that. Hmm. Maybe some of these. Not that color. <laughs> Yeah, not really sure if this is the right right way to go. Let's try these. Or actually, do we have any fun fun wallpapers? I don't really know if I have any pet related wallpapers. <laughs> Potentially not. Um Oh, that's adorable. Hmm, I need to use the, this somewhere else. Let's see. Oh, I, I really want to use this, but ah, uh, uh, <laughs> that's one option. That's one option. Yeah, I really do want to see Fox. Oh, you know what, guys? I never realized that. <laughs> I thought that that's something completely different. That actually looks pretty cool. And it works with the with the flooring too. It has little deers. Fantastic. So th these wallpapers are made by Shastkis. And I'm not sure where she uploaded those. Perhaps Live Channel? But I do know that Shasta has a Tumblr, so if you want to check out or try to find these wallpapers, uh, I think the best option is to Google Shasta Kiss and her Tumblr. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> okay, there we go. There we go. But I do know that Shasta is uh, Shasta should be still active in the community, so you should be able to find find her stuff but let's go ahead and move this here and yeah by the way guys what comes to um, where can I find uh, questions in general I I've had usually basically in every episode um, you guys some of you guys asking where to find certain things and unfortunately it is not possible for possible for me to like physically it's not physically possible for me to answer or to be able to find every single item that you guys want to potentially find because like I like I have said several times um, I've collected my CC for the game over the 
like the past seven years basically and it's some of them are not online anymore and it's just it's going to be a lot of um it's it's not going to be easy potentially to be able to find all the things but if you can see the uh, tooltips or the like the description here and you can see the creator's name the best option is always to just google and try to find it that way or if some of you guys in the comments know where to find certain things and you can you see people asking in the comments you can go ahead and help them you can you can point them to the right direction and help help like that because we are simmers and we do that that sort of stuff so so there we go guys just wanted to give a little heads up what comes to the uh where can i find but um i do try to help as much as i can and try to um try to answer to those questions but it's sometimes difficult and all that so hope you guys understand but anyway, let's move on and let's see. Yes, I want that. Hmm. Let's go with the blue one, actually. Yeah, so we are going to have... I think we are only going to have one display because you can actually buy both uh, cats and dogs from one display. So you don't, you don't, don't need uh, several of these to be able to do that. And let's go ahead. Hmm. Can I place it here? That's interesting. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that window is not really working how, how I wanted it to look. But anyway, let's place this here for now. So that I, I know which model I wanted to use. But I'm actually really, really pleased with the color scheme of the pet store here already. I really, really enjoy this. I haven't used this wallpaper ever before, I don't think. <laughs> but anyway, let's go ahead and uh, add some some stuff to the restroom here. Just some basic things, basic toilet. And I'm pretty sure I should have, yes, a recolor for that. And anything else? Lighting. Let's see. Hmm. Okay, that's fine. And we can have a couple of, a couple of these basic lightings or these, um, basic lights here that's fine actually and let's see where's the exit sign here we go all right yeah I'm liking this so far and let's actually go ahead and just finish the upstairs at least what comes to the um, what comes to the flooring and the walls so that we can actually start uh, decorating more in the next episode let's go ahead let's see where is that one one flooring that I used hmm, not that Do, do, do. Hmm. I still need some more flooring. <laughs> um mm, that's not going to work. Hmm. I feel like this is too big. The pattern is too big. Okay, let's go with this. Yeah, that's going to be fine. And I need to replace that. 
and that. And let's see the wallpapers here. I don't think I want to go with the same one actually. Hmm. But let's see, something fun. Okay, not that. I'm checking the uh, the titles or the descriptions now <laughs> to see if there's any animal related things. Um, hmm. Yeah, I want to use those somewhere else. But maybe something... Something like this. Not that. <laughs> um, yeah, not really what I'm looking for. Oh, that's adorable. For a kid's room. Um, hmm. Okay, let's try this. <laughs> I feel like it's going to be a little too much. And actually, I can see it already. Yeah, it's going to be a little too much of this this pattern. So let's go with something, just something clean. Um, doo -doo -doo. I feel like that's going to be a little too dark. Wow, I'm really having trouble with this now. <laughs> um. Okay, guys, give me a second. All right, guys, so <laughs> it actually took me a while to figure out what I want to do with the, with the uh, walls and floors here. But I decided to go with something something basic. So this is the uh, the color that I chose and it kind of matches with the with the downstairs flooring. So I'm, I'm just fine with that and some green. Uh, for the floor but I think we are actually pretty much done what comes to uh, this episode I want to get started with this um, with the kind of the exterior you know change the change the exterior walls here and kind of figure out what kind of look I want this building to have and I'm really liking this I feel like the um, the wood uh, what is called <laughs> <laughs> oh, the wood siding. I feel like this is going to work better um, for the island than to have a lot of um, just brick, brick buildings or whatnot. So I do want to use that more and definitely with the other buildings or the other businesses as well. But I do want to add a little window here. It always bugs me when this these kind of places are too dark. So let's see, um, I should have some little windows. There we go. That's fine. And actually, let's see. Yeah, I really need to, it really bugs me that I can't see the recolors for these big windows. I used to have them, but I, I don't know, maybe, maybe it's something to do with the uh do, do what it's called even <laughs> oh my goodness anyway the program that that actually enables us to use recolors that's what i mean but yeah i just i can't can't have any um recolors for the biggest windows or maybe there aren't any i'm not sure but i really want to use these big windows for the dis displays but anyway yeah i was uh, was trying to see Start babbling, and I wanted to see do 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 these windows here. 
Uh, maybe not the open one though. Let's see. Is this better? Yeah. I like it. It works. <laughs> and let's see. I really do want to use these little windows too. Maybe we can use them here. Maybe. Not sure. <laughs> let's just put it there. And we can use some some more privacy windows for the bed uh, bedroom bathroom that would be ideal um let's see there are these these tiny ones though well that's not so tiny <laughs> okay let's go with this one fantastic privacy more privacy no one sees that you are you are taking a pee. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, I think we are going to end it here. I will uh, continue working in the next episode. We are going to do a lot more interior decorating and add some some fun pet items and get this place ready for some new clients or, or new uh, sims that are coming here to buy some pets. So that's going to be exciting. Thanks so much guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this little decorating slash building episode and I will see you next time in The Sims 2.